Welcome back everybody, welcome back to part two of our break pass series here at Travaux's Golf and Country Club, playing here in the Devon Cornwall PGA. If not caught up with part one, make sure you go and check that out. There is birdies flying around everywhere from Joe the Pro, and he's on a real mission to get a little title under his belt. Tenth hole, let's get out there, break pass series. Tenth hole, par five, 503 yards. Fairway split into two by a little stream and a nice couple of bridges. A few bunkers up near the green. Screen from what I remember will slope from right to left, so I think the pin's on the left today. Down on that line. Down. You're right on that. Go on, go on. Yeah, it's bounced a couple of times. Sharp. Good head, Paul. Some speed there, Paul. Yeah, that's the speed. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, one tough bounce away from being in the ditch. Oh, I wish one day I could be as good as that guy. Full power stance. He's got everything, hasn't he? Not one shot he doesn't have. Full left. Should be down the other fairway down, I think. I'd be lying if I said I'd lived there before. Right, Jordan, I've got three wood. I've got 256 yards of the Front. I can't get there unless I really trap and hook one. Yeah. Which is kind of the shot, really, but. The wind is perfect for that shot. It's out the right, isn't it? Right behind me as we're looking now, and obviously the hole's down here, so that's coming across this way. At the moment. It was trappy and hooky. It was not definitely trappy and hooky. Started it a bit left. Yeah. Well, what have you got, Paul? 240, I got, mate. I'm going to hit a little three wood. I feel the wind's just kind of out the right and maybe hurting a touch, so. Beauty, mate. Sit, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Chasing up a dream, that. Great shot. You're right, that. Any ideas, Jordan? Hmm. Who knows? Thanks, mate. Don't know for you. It's hard to uh, be about five clubs longer than me, so. <laughs> The bunker somehow. Stay short. Yep, I think it might do. Right on the top edge again. Yeah. Got down here, just up the left, just just stay short of the really thick rough ball way below his feet. He's got 65 yards over a bunker. Looks very good that. Very nice. Very good. Not bad for a twitch <laughs> twitcher. Oh, Joe. Delicious. Go on, roll, roll, roll. That's a Hendrickson bunker shot if I've ever seen one. In your face, Paul. <laughs> Another birdie. Well done. Another birdie. Well Numero he seis. part two as he left off with yeah. part one. Unreal, isn't it? Yeah. Absolute masterclass. Absolute delight to what I'm, I'm glad I'm here with him. Always like a bit of good golf, George. Hmm. You know? And YouTube golf can provide it, you know? It's not just about Sky TV and all that, you know? Mm. You never get this close to the pros, Dan, you know? No, not mic'd up as well. No, you're yeah, mic'd up. You hear all their thoughts. Mic'd up with Joe the Pro. Inside my brain, Jordan. No. It's a scary place. <laughs> you won't come out. <laughs> you will, but you'll never be the same. <laughs> Lovely putt, mate. Much better judging I thought that was three. Well done, Paul. Short. <laughs> Pretty good. Well done, Paul. Right, Dan, don't be the odd one out who doesn't make birdie down here. Oh, come on. Man. Learn anything off Paul? Do you know, I thought it was actually walking onto the screen. I thought it was downhill, but it's actually maybe even slightly uphill. Yeah, it's that little little ridge coming off the side of the green there. Yeah, all swung a lot. Yeah. Yes, sir. No, no, yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we got a little. There. We got a little. A little shooter. Huh? Wow. Birdies everywhere. This is a very, this is a competitive little uh, PGA medal, isn't it? Birdies flying all over the place. Most important bit right now. This halfway hut, George. Oh yeah. Best one in the southwest. So whenever you come to Dravos, 
you've got to go to the halfway hut on 10. It's actually on the back of the 10th green. And if we have a little look inside. All right, George, what are you getting? Two bacon sandwiches, three sausage sandwiches, and two beers. Literally the best three halfway beers. hut in the, world. in the whole of the south of England. There right, you go. Thank you very much. I'll thank take you. that. Have a great afternoon, guys. Bye, bye, bye. See you soon. Oh, it's lovely in there, isn't it? Beautiful. It's nicely nice and warm as well, isn't it? Like a little bit of, little bit of respite for you, George. Now, That's the uh, issue. When you go in there, you don't want to come out. <laughs> One, nine, three, hole 11. Par three, really tricky, triple tiered green and the pin looks like it's right on the top tier. Two bunkers left, a massive runoff off the front, so you've got to get it back all the way. A cut more. Yeah. Wind's just grabbed it now and taken it. Bunker line. Just over it's it. Plenty of bat though, Jack. It's about pin on. I just tugged it, yeah. Is that four iron, Dan? It was a four. Three iron. Five iron shot. Are you talking to me? No. Okay. So you're not always have to be centre of attention all the time, you know. It's about me. Do you want to hear what I thought about that? <laughs> I know, I think it's a three iron. Three iron. Yeah, that's true. It's actually not going to be all that bad, Dan. No. You're not going to be pitching over bunkers. You've got plenty of good. Just body stops, you know. <laughs> Do you want to hear any more about me, Jordan? You've got about 10 seconds if you My want My favourite colour is purple, Gemini, yeah. really? uh, Newcastle fan. Well, oh, enough said. That's, that's how you do it. That's how you control a bull flight. Love it. Just letting the wind just move it onto the flag now. Thanks, oh, sir. Paul. That's quality, Paul. Really, really good. That made me feel things, Paul. I'm not going to lie. Just no reaction, though. It's just a normal day in the office, isn't it? Joker. Yep. Another day. Look at that seat there. Is that your tea? No, I don't know who that is. Is that your tea? Sorry. Just a little mark. Mark of the joke. Woven? 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 I put that in Joe's pocket, so it says, yeah. Probably is mine, yeah. That's going to look good on camera. I'm just going to straight on this tea that I've got on the screen. I kind of want to bump that. Yeah. No worse than having an 83 degree light angle puzzle. 99. Bump it, try not to get any grab on it. Where are you trying to land it? Just at this front part of this and let it bump up the hill. Yeah. A bit like that, Dan. Well, Come on then, roll out right, and go right. right. Go right. Yeah, it's trying. Yeah, we're try. Very good. Joe's looking for his tea. You're right with the figure. Who's had his tea? He's got a putter. Yeah, just. It's tricky, isn't it? There's no. Yeah, I don't know. It's like. It's, quick. it's not quite a perfect enough lie to flip it up. No. And there's not loads of green. Pragmatic and try and bundle it somewhere close. Yep. Come on, down. Oh, Joe, yeah, that's so good. What a bundle! Bundle of excellence. Tapping it in for his par ski. There we are. Good three, Joe. Good up and down, sir. Okay. I'm trying to follow Joe in for his path. Stay up. Oh. Fantastic. Fantastic. What a putt. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Thank you. All the way. Rolled end over end. Two momentum keeping up and down, back to back. I would say even more important than birdie. Yeah. <laughs> Mentally. <laughs> Mentally, yeah. Paul looking for a two here. Which would be unbelievable. Yeah, the three. Unlucky. Three yeah. trees, you take it. Yeah. Tricky one to read that, isn't it? Yeah, I just overread it. You've got to dribble it, and then when you want to dribble it, you put more break into it and blah, blah, blah. Take mm. a three, though. Right, hole 12, par four, four, five, one. Up the hill, dog leg left. Couple of bunkers at the left, which are right in range. And you're playing up to a bunker, uh, a green that's protected by a bunker. Uh, it slopes on back to front. A stroke of next one. That is seriously bomber line, that, isn't it? No. I got a five for that shot next. 
Shot yeah, bolt. Very good. Good shake. Absolutely spot on. I don't think we had that cover, mate. Yeah. Pull 196 yards, got a three iron. The pin is directly over the top of a bunker today. So I imagine he's going slightly right of it just to open the green up. Bit left. Yeah, pin eye left. Not, not terrible over there, chipping a putt. Five wood then. Five wood, George. 214 middle. Stay on the line. Bounce, I think. It bounced right, didn't it? Yeah, but it's caught the trap, I think. Yeah. Unfortunately, Joe's got to go back to the tea and play a provisional. We cannot find his ball up here. I thought it was just up the left, just past the trap, but it's a bit damp, so I'm wondering if it's kind of plugged and we just can't find it. So, provisional ball. Joe the pro playing in his provisional, or as now is three off the tee. This is unbelievably unfair, really. I'm pretty, pretty sure I saw it down. Just could not find it. Doesn't like it. Bit right, maybe. Yeah, short right there. Hope he bounces back from this because that's a really unfortunate situation. Okay, Dan's just found the front left trap. Probably got a 35 yard bunker shot all uphill. Quite a tricky shot, this, to get it all the way back to the pin. Played it very well. That is very good. Left himself an uphill putt as well. Well done. I'm actually um, not in good shape here because that sprinkler. Yeah, that's a sprinkler right here. Is exactly is the line. I'll go right of it. I could end up down right, way right, and if I end up left of it, I'm going to end up with a tough little putt. Then I have the lie to go over it. Not impressed. Just skipped forward, didn't it? Didn't didn't, didn't make the break at all. Should kick. It just kind of kicked left on you. Very good. So good. <coughs> Come on round. Keep going, yeah? Very good. Got very good. Not a sun safe. Really? Yeah. Great sun <laughs> a, a very little comprehension of what actually what happened. What actually is going on there? <laughs> it's a bit of a blur that for uh, poor old Joe. Hole 13, half five. Dog leg down to the left, out of bounds all down the left. You're kind of trying to hit your drive roughly to where the greenkeeper is. And then to be honest, it's just a layup because it, it really gets tight down there and the out of bounds down the left looms. So safe play, try and make your birdie that way. Laughing. <laughs> <laughs> it's centre of the sorry, I've just walked straight the shot coach. It's centre of the fairway back where that tractor is, you would think. Yeah. Uh yeah, well, yeah, no, yeah. Pull, pull. Oh yeah, it's oh, oh, a slight bit of anger in there. <laughs> That's on the tractor. It's a bounce back. Wow, that's just my luck. That'll get lost lost yeah. ball in the track. Okay. Yeah, I saw it down, it's down the hill. Lucky boy down. How is that? How do you ever skip through a Lynx bunker? Like the faces are so it's like it's hit, you can see it there, but really. Um so I've got a bit of grass to deal oh, with. Behind it, there we go. Issue. 150 leaves me 150. You like 150? Try and thump a seven iron out. Yep. 
It's lying quite well. You've managed to avoid all the wispy stuff as well, yeah, haven't you? Yeah, keep it down the right. There's a bunker down the left here, and then it opens the green up a little bit. Yeah. Pin looks back. Front left today. Back, yeah, front left. Kind of a, like a punch, you know? I don't want to catch this. Perfect. Hook a bit, hook a bit. Hook a bit, then. Don't quite see it down okay. over the bunker, but pretty good. Right, what have you got, Paul? I've got like two aces to pin. But I've got bunkers everywhere. Like 220 on me, so. That's going to place something up to about 210. Okay. There's nothing to be gained from uh, taking those traps on, I think, to try and get them. Draw the trap in the trap. Yeah, the trap. What you got, Joe? I can't get the flag, but I've got 230 to get past that bunker that looks green side. The pin's beyond that, so I'm thinking it's at least 240, 250. Yeah. Um, can drive, by the way. Thanks, mate. Bit of uh, bit of anger in that. Yeah, felt a little bit hard that night on the last. I yeah. certainly didn't expect to lose that. I'm going to go slightly more aggressive. I'm going to get three iron to try and get it past past the bunkers. Because short, you leave yourself horrible down. So even if this goes sort of back fringe, back long, it should be playable, I think. Just leaking a little bit down the right. See that down, Joe? Yeah, pin eye just 10 yards off the right of the green. Uh, there's it? a little swale down there. That should be all right. You'll be able to get a putter on that. How do people, how can people react the way, obviously, there's an unfortunate scenario of what you've gone through there. What, what, any advice to people for that, really? I mean, it hurts, I know, but... Yeah, I mean, it's like a... I guess, it, I, the way I always try and look at it, you haven't got anything until you've finished anyway. So if you're thinking, oh, great, I'm, well, I'm five under par, and now I've given it back and I'm two. I never had five under, because I hadn't signed for it, I hadn't finished, it was just a... So, and there's still... I don't know, you've caught me in an emotional time. Yeah, Dan. I know I have, and I do apologise. <laughs> but you're, you're absolutely spot on. Absolutely spot yeah, you on. Don't you, have, just... you don't have, nothing's given until it's owned for. So you've, whether you're five under, eight under, one under, whatever it is, you can't take that as a given. So get on with it, no, see what it's like at the end. Obviously, really, just especially when you think I felt it was a really good well. shot. You're playing well, yeah. and you just get out an unfortunate break. Yeah, Goal. So that's life. One two seven flag. I think that pin's literally tucked on the front, isn't it? Yeah, it looks like it. Just over that little hump. It's downwind. I'm going to see if I can just force a fifty there. Okay. I don't know where that is. I can't see it down. Mud ball for Paul. Did oh. stop short of the sand, but. I think I'd rather it in than that amount of mud behind yeah. the ball there. That's right. Right where you're going to hit. Right, gonna hit right in the pub there at 73 yards. No real idea how this is gonna come out. I think that's a pretty good result. Kind of came out as, as if there was no mud there. Yeah. Some layout that ball. Wow. Not your numbers, Joe. Not happy with the lie. It's very fair. It's very you know. Um, lush around it and it's just sat on a little patch of mud which is going to make the strike interesting yeah come out lovely oh joe just have to dig it out thanks mate unbelievable Delightful. look at that look at all the slopes you can see the slopes on the camera you can see them on the camera you know they're severe to land it on top of it it's really lovely Right. Cheeky little yeah. precipice this, isn't it? It's like it wanted to go right, but it... Uh, yeah. Just hung out there, didn't it? Yeah, it, it might wiggle that way at the end. Kind of went that way at the start, and then it just... Went the other way, didn't it? But... but. Ooh, I didn't like that one. No. I couldn't find the brake on it and I didn't want to hit it straight. Mm. Well done, Joe. Great bounce back. Thanks, Ed. Very good, mate. Well, 14, par 4, dog leg left, 319. Do you think it is? 
I'm going to go over the corner of the Greenkeeper's Complex to green a little bunch scattered. Good hole. Oh yeah, all over it. So good. So over it. Literally over the over that white post. Could be in the hole, Joe. Nice. Might be. That'd be a good start for holding one on the show. Yeah. So, so good. And we couldn't even see it go in. <laughs> Shot pull. Very good. Little draw into the wide bit of the fairway. Perfect. Here she goes. Great shot, Dan. How far you got, Dan? 88 yards. Slightly downwind. Pretty good. Fraction left of the stick, just whether it's pin eye or not. Just maybe released. A, is it released a bit too much? Just kicked left on me a little bit. Yeah, not too bad. Tough shot with that angle, actually. You are doing a grand job with that camera there, Joe the Pro. Thanks, Dan. Technical wizard. The skills you have is amazing. Paul, what have you got? 54 yards. 54 yards? 60. 64. I've got a 58. 58. It's, uh, it's going to be pretty tricky. Yeah, this is downwind. not ideal. It's going to go Nasty away. bunker here. Bunker. Not ideal, really. Sit, 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 Wait. sit, 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 just a little hard. Yeah, it's one of those, isn't it? You don't want to. Definitely don't want to be coming up short. Greenside bunker for Joe the Pro. You can see on the um, line here where he trundled in. So he's coming from the top of the bunker. So maybe he just crept in. That's a great shot. Nice, Joe. Great. Yeah, lovely. Good. We thought we were better, good bunker players. He is putting on a show today, isn't he? He's putting on a show today. Pull long uphill off the left birdie chance. Oh. Great putt, Paul. We haven't talked about Dan's little hand warming pouch that he's wearing. Oh. Wow. Pop. Yes. Pop joke. Great yes. bird. Number seven. Is that birdie number seven? I think eight or nine, isn't it? Huh? Is it? I've had a triple. I've had a triple and a. I could be wrong. And I've had a triple and certainly another, but it's at least eight. Oh, okay. 4.15, dog leg left par 4, 3.17, bunkers everywhere, great little hole, it's not the longest in the world but it's tricky to manage and Joe is just going balls to the wall with the driver. Oh. The yeah perfect, there she is, middle of the fairway. Shot pull. The right hole down the middle of the fairway. Where are they coming from? <laughs> They're coming off that tee over there. Yeah. yeah nice. Nice ball fight on that one. Little riser. Yeah, 98 yards I've got. Okay. Into wind. I've got oh, you 54, hit? but I'm yeah. not sure that's getting there. I just don't want to spin it off the front here because it's. So I'm going to go with a little knockdown 50. Okay. It's pretty good. Just going to be left of the green. Oh, it's stopped stop, stop. short. A little bit short stop. and spun up. Good job you doing it at 54. No way I was getting there, was it? No. It's quite a bit so of wind there now. Much wind today. It's, yeah, it's just picked up in the last 30 minutes, really. Well, I've got 68 yards yep. into a good stiff wind uphill. So I'm going to try and play it like a. Almost an 80 yard shot, I think. Nice. Stop, 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 stop. Wow. Stop, stop. Stop. Oh, that's, that's crazy. Feels a bit hard done by that. Where have you got to land that? <laughs> I don't know where you can land it. A little further up the fairway, we've got Paul. What have you got? 
I've got 83 yards. 83, yeah. I'm going to play it with 52. Okay. I've just seen yours come up short, and I've just seen Joe's spin a lot off the front. So, I'm yeah, you try and land it maybe just past the pin if I can. Yeah, there's a just... big ridge back behind this flag, if I remember. Yeah, it's really picked up this last sort of 10, 15 minutes, really picked up. Oh, cool. Yeah, very nice. Well done, good four. Cut them. Right. Yeah, good boy. Ah, good four. Like if I got anywhere but perfectly straight, it's going to fall. Yeah. Oh, nice. A couple of few pars there. Well, well, I don't know where we are at the scores at the moment. What are you, Joe? You're four under again. I'm four, yeah. I'm level, you're one under. Thank you. I'm okay. two under. Oh, you're level? Two under. I'm level. I might be one under. I don't even know where I'm at. Well, <laughs> it'll know. be on the screen then. It'll be all on the screen for everyone to see. Sixteenth hole, par three, really tough, long par three, one nine six. Bunkers left, bunker right, green slopes from front to back, really difficult hole this one. Back left on it. Feels like it wants to move. Know, so Oh yeah, great shot. Yeah, it's good. I think that's pretty good. Yeah, that was a pretty good. It's about 15 foot. That was a seven. 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 That's a dilemma. Oh, speed training. Paul has been doing some work in the nets. Right in the stick somewhere in the middle of the green. Yeah. yeah, oh wow. Very good, similar yeah. line to Very me. Good. Yeah. Very holdable one. What was that, Very seven? I'll tell you eight. It just went completely blind. What, I, what I did you hit? I there, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> no. That was a seven iron. Hmm. Have some of that, Paul. Some of those lost. Nine iron. Check his loss out. Check it. All three balls are past the flag, which I wasn't expecting to be honest, but as I said, in the drone flyover, it all slopes from front to back, so you do normally find yourself at the back of this green. Roll out ball. Try it. Roll, roll out ball. Roll out ball. Oh, <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> oh no. Oh no. How's that not moved? Talk, talk to it, Joe. Talk to it. It's still got a chance. Take it away. Take it out. Take it right. I was waiting for you to do something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's just you. Oh, no. Good three. Wow. Robbed. That was coming in all the way, and it was. stopped right at the end. It was. That's for birdie number nine, which, to be fair, would have been taking the mick a little bit. I think. Links golf with not a lot of wind, isn't it? It's amazing. And then someone with a lot of power. Yeah. That's what you can do to a links course. It's amazing. Still very talented, Dan. Oh! Oh! Yes. <laughs> oh! oh. Okay. Hang on! Shoot it! I was getting worried you hadn't held one of those. I know, I know. <laughs> I know. Just one around, generally. Maybe a couple. It's going to feel even worse about mine. <laughs> Good putt, though, Joe. Oh, thanks, yeah. What's that? Two? Three? Two? Three? Three. See if Paul can follow him in. Hmm. 
Hole 17, par 4, normally plays 410 but it's probably playing about 360 today. They've got this one on a temporary green because they're doing some work to the current green. have got a remodel which they, they're always at doing around Travaux which is great to see. Um, so it's just a little temporary short of the ditch down there but basically you want to get your drive away as far down there as you can really. Bunker's right side. Straight over the path. Bit unlucky, Dan. You just caught the upslope here. Yeah, I your drive, which has just killed it. Bit necky, bit cutty. But we've got a temporary green. They're, they've built, they've rebuilt the green, and we'll. They have, yeah, still working on it, but they've completely taken a lot of the slope out. It used to be a big slope back to front, and um, there's a little ditch there in front that you can't quite see, but playing to a temporary today. Yeah, which is actually a really tough shot because that stream is just behind it. Yeah. So I've got 90, 99, 99, 89 yards. 89 yards to the flag. 58. 58. Wind is straight out the left. Pretty good. Yeah, like that, Dan. Very nice. Well done. Um, well, I've got 70 yards. That's a little temporary. Yeah. Dropped it out the GUR into a bit of a hole. <laughs> I'm just going to try and gouge it out. You've been good at that today, though. That's, that's a great shot, Joe. Well out of that. How do you gauge your yardages so well when you're trying to hit like diggy ones? Yeah? Do you know what? It's I'd all feel, isn't it? Yeah, I think it, it is. is. It's like, yeah, it is. You just sort of know what speed coming through the ball. Some people do like clock face systems, don't they? And yeah, they yeah. Like nine o'clock goes like this. I just, I feel it as a speed through the ball. That speed goes yeah. X amount. Yeah, like, yeah, that's, yeah. that's how I thought. But like, yeah, out, out of a that was, I'll be brutally honest, that's just luck, that's guesswork. You, you, you're hoping it's going to come out how you think. Yeah. So you hit it that hard in your head accordingly. If it comes out hotter, then it goes further. If it comes out soft, it doesn't sit. Yeah, it's all feel, isn't it? Yeah, very nice. Did you get hold of that drive? Uh, it was all right. I just blocked it a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it sounded great. How far? 66 yards? Yeah. yeah. You're just going to carry that ridge, really. That's the, um, that's the key. I can't wait to see what this looks like when we get up there and then to see it unfold. I say it so often about this place, but they just love, oh, just reinvest, reinvest, keep, keep improving. Just popping it forward, go on. Go on, release, release, release. No. Little scarecrow. It's got a little yellow hard hat on made out of a football. Like it does. <laughs> Could that be his jacket? <laughs> it might be actually. Oh. Pretty good, Paul. Yeah, not bad, mate. What are you doing with it, Dan? Are you leaving it in or are you? Uh, no, no, it weighs good for me. What are you thinking about when reading temporary greens? Just pace, really. Yeah. Get it around the fucking hole in the hole there. Except whatever happens. <laughs> Oh. Wait, how long has that run out for a fairway? Bear in mind this is technically a fairway, that's um... Well, rolled actually really pure. Yeah. Oh. Little raft or... Thought that was in all the way.
No. I'm lucky, mate. You didn't deserve that. Not for me, that one. <coughs> not for me. Difficult, difficult temporary greens, just completely different. A lot of the time it's a coin toss. Never expect it to roll as true as it did, so. Hence why he was so far past. Putt pull. Oh. The two putt. Incredible scenes. Or oh, is that a one putt? That's a one that. putt. It is a one putt, isn't it? Well, Shot scope will be loving that. Yeah. 18th hole, 423 yard par 4 up the hill, absolutely stunning. Got a bunker to go past off the tee on the right and then it all feeds around from right to left into the fairway. Then your approach is going over the road up to an elevated green with bunkers in front. Mounds and bunkers to the right and then a big drop off to the left, absolutely great hole. Oh, what's that? I'd hit a provisional there. It's quite, isn't it? Yeah. Shot ball. Such a good hit. High in the face as well, it Maximise. You've inspired me there. <laughs> Shot down. I've got provisional one. This has got a pink line. The other keep running. Dots. Nice. Is it still running? Yep. Keep running. She's still running. She's running past mine. Provisional for Joe. That's yeah. That was her. Though. It's gonna be a sad end to a break par where I don't break par from four under. <laughs> Oh, Keep going. Stay positive. <laughs> I think I honestly, <laughs> yeah, we're all we're all with you. All I'm, gonna, right, we're all I'm with saying you. it now. I think that first one. Come on, you'll be, right. you'll be fine. Yeah, it's going to be quite dramatic TV. <laughs> if it's not, when I destroy all of my plans. <laughs> uh, this might be the last interview. Yeah. <laughs> provisional. Okay. Titleist three. Joe, the provisional. Yeah, the one. That's the one. Yeah, man. That's the one. That's the one. Just a little bomber, straight in the mid. We'll see that one. We'll see, we'll see. I feel like I wanted to tiger line it again. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, almost, like it's almost reached the road. Thinking of there, what is that tiger I, line? I think it's end line, isn't it? From, I thought, well, yeah, it probably is, but it's quite aggressive. <laughs> it's it's aggressive. very, it's wow. very it aggressive. Right and it all kicks left. Yeah, I'm an aggressive rifle. <laughs> that's probably, you know, that's the perfect line, but it brings in a bit of danger, that line. Okay, boys, coming up 18. It feels what? like we're coming up 18 as well. Uh, it feel, honestly it feels, feels like I'm coming up the 36. I feel like I've run <laughs> around this golf course today. It's been a real challenge, but um, talked about it all the way around. But the changes that they've made here at Chavos, pretty impressive, aren't they? Just year on year. They're just always doing something. They're not, they don't rest on what they've got. They always, they've always got a project on every year. And then you come back and, you know, you, you've been coming here for, 20 odd years now yeah. probably and you just see what it every year you come back there's a new green or new tee or yeah. new bunkers or something it's it's quite incredible really yeah it's really good to see really good to see oh that was very frustrating little three putt on 17 there um it's one of those jordan asked me you know what are you thinking about when you take the putt on temporary greens like this and it's like i said just pace and i just thought like slightly uphill can't be running any quicker than the than the greens but one of those kind of gets away from you, a little frustrating, but you know, let's see if we can finish strong. Great hole, great approach. Come on, one good shot. One good, one more good shot. Here we go. Get up. Skip, skip. skip. Yeah. I think I might oh, be putting high. Might be putting. Yeah. yeah. We've got 150. Uphill window for the left, we've got eight time. Oh yeah. Get there then. Get there. Yeah. Great Excellent. shot. Excellent. Have you got that to break par? <laughs> <laughs> Have you got that? <laughs> Joe, you're gonna be burning with your third ball. You beat me. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> oh no. Derby. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh. What a story.
Yeah. What's the story? Can't, can't Joe. There's 20,000 people wanting to get this up and down. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> Get this up and down, it'll be the most exciting braking part that's ever been. Yeah. Yes. I've just gone. I have gone. Go on then, Joe. Go on then, Joe. Oh, oh no way. It would, wouldn't it? It would. Spring. Wow. Right yeah. There, it? <laughs> Still in your way, or you're right? Right on it. Just about done. Yeah, yeah. Pretty oh. good effort. Not easy, that. So tough to get it high enough, isn't it? I should have gone the other way. <laughs> Round the sprinkler. Round yeah. yeah. Great three, Paul. Great three. Well done. Well done, Joe. Well done, Joe. Oh, I'm lucky, mate. Possible to go in that way. Thank you, mate. It's always a pleasure. Always hugging it out. 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 Very good. Right, everyone. Big thank you for watching. Obviously, a big thank you to Travos, but and a big thank you to these two boys. That is our break pass series. Thanks for watching.